everybody, Zapjack here with another edition of the Attack Line for Thursday, August 11th of 2011. It was a very breezy afternoon here on the weather here, so let's get down to business. Before I do, I gotta close my door. Anyway, sorry to do that. First things first, VMA news, a VMA update for today. Bruno Mars has been confirmed to perform at the VMAs. He has been added alongside Adele, Lil Wayne, Chris Brown, and also new and up and coming act who no one cares about as of now. To after the show, probably. Young the Giant. Although we still, still do not know a host. It will be like less than two weeks for this event, by the way. Two weeks from Sunday. We still don't know who your host is. But we all know who's presenting. The first round of presenters. The group Odd Future. Whose member Tyler, the creator, is nominated for a couple awards, including Best New Artist and Album and Video of the Year. Also been confirmed, Selena Gomez to present. Kim Kardashian, and I forgot the others off the top of my head right now. But I know they've announced some people to present the awards. And of course, it'll take place on Sunday, August 28th at 9 8 Central. Thank God I don't have to get that night so I can watch it. And as I mentioned on my attack line on Tuesday night, I mentioned on my attack line on Tuesday that they're going to announce some. Names for the Michael Jackson tribute concert yesterday. Well, they did. I mentioned CeeLo Green. I mentioned Craig David on Tuesday's show. And I recently also said on Tuesday that Christina Galera was confirmed. Well, woman. Well, she's now confirmed. She and CeeLo are the two main headliners. Alongside Craig David and another fellow British star, Leona Lewis, Motown legend and friend of the Jackson family, Smokey Robinson. It's probably the oddest band on the list right now. Uh, Evo alternative band, who, the only reason why they are involved in this is because they covered Michael Jackson's Smooth Criminal in 2001. F, Alien at Farm. There's another one in the Well, they now call them. More names have yet to be confirmed. There's a rumor of Kanye and Jay Z still, and maybe Usher. So hopefully, more names shall be confirmed for this event. Michael Jackson tribute concert in Wales, the Millennium Center, on October the 8th. Don't know where that'll be, America time. So, with that in mind, let's continue on this very short edition of the Attack Line today with my TNA Impact preview for tonight. Yes, I will be watching it and I'll be reviewing it at 11, after 11. So, keep your eyes out for a TNA Impact review. Let's get started with the preview with what I do. Top five questions that need to be answered for tonight. Question number Question number five. Who are Get more points in the Battle for Glory series. Well, they haven't announced any Battle for Glory series matches yet. Probably will announce more for the ninth show. So keep your eyes posted for more matches for Battle for Glory series. Question number four. What will go down with Winter being the new Knockouts champion? Winter, of course, won this past Sunday at Hardcore Justice with a little help from Angelina. So we'll see if Winter... Games make you rematch or not. So we'll see what goes down there. Question number three. Will Sting get a rematch against Kurt Angle? We'll see if he does or not. Question number two. Will anything be announced for No Surrender besides the Final Four? Well, we're going to start building No Surrender soon. And question number one for tonight's impact that must be answered. What will Kurt Angle have to say? Well, Kurt Angle got a little help from Hulk Hogan this past Sunday, but apparently he's saying he's apparently not taking it well. He's letting it clear that Hogan, 
he's not joining a moto. Angle's not joining a moto, apparently. He's going to address Dixie Carter. He kind of believes the whole Dixie Carter thing like Sting does. Maybe that's why Sting's been champion. I want to be champ so I can get Dixie Carter back and bring the TNA that I love back instead of the Bishop Hogan administration that's been ruining the company. We will see what goes down, what happened with Angle, what happened with Angle and Dixie Carter in tonight's Impact. And that is it for tonight's Attack Line. Very quick one tonight. I'll see you all tomorrow for another one. See you later tonight for T-Day Impact Review. With that in mind, this has been Tech. But in the news, I'm Zach. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. I'll see you later. Bye-bye.